Priya asks, I'm going to take my first time to prep test tomorrow. Should I complete four or five sections? Uh, doesn't matter too much. I would say typically start with four, then work up to five just so that you're building your endurance bit by bit. Obviously, time sections are tough to do in general. And if you're doing four, I would still do have give yourself a break between the second and third sections just so that you are not putting yourself through too much. Obviously, doing four sections in a row is totally going to fry your brain beyond what you'll even experience on test day. So for that reason, I would recommend just doing two or three back-to-back -back timed, then taking a break and doing others. So you could do two, break, two more. You could do three, break, one. And then, of course, three, break, two. And if you really want to go crazy to build up your endurance, some at some point down the line, you could do three, break, three. Because doing if you could do six sections, then you could certainly do five. So I would say don't put yourself through too much. Take plenty of breaks. Don't do timed exams on back-to-back -back days because that leads to burnout. But other than that, have at it. You, I wouldn't do more than three timed exams a week, but you could certainly do two in a week or three here and there. If you're taking the LSAT a few months from now, you have plenty of time to work on those exams. I'd say you're probably having taken 10 timed exams under strict, realistic test day conditions. That's that's enough. Some people do more. And of course, there's benefit. But the real benefit to doing a timed exam comes from analog, you're the post game analysis, not only just what was your score, but the experience of, t of timing yourself in those real test day like conditions being very strict with the 35 minutes. If you go to the bathroom, it counts. If you have a sip of water, that counts. If something distracts you that's going on around you, like maybe you know, your friend or roommate or something or someone at the coffee shop, that counts because on test day, you might also have the proctors kind of circling around you or other test takers who are annoying. So keep all of that in mind as you do your timed exams.